type TP for tool palettes, press enter, then click on annotation. Then here is the arrow. There are two types of arrow one is imperial and other is metric. Choose as per your requirement. I will take this imperial, then click OK, then give the point where you want to insert it and zoom it. By clicking on it, you can change its length, you can make it reverse and by clicking on this dot you can change the angle and give the required angle. Escape, because we will add some more arrow and we will copy it to see different options in it. Escape, again click on this arrow, then click here, here is different types of arrows are there, one is arch. From here you can reverse it, from here you can change the angle. Then next is double. From here you can change the length from your angle. Then next is fancy, change the length, change the angle. Then next is flex. From here you can increase the size, from here you can increase the length. Then next is trail. From here you can increase the length. Escape. Then if you want to change the size of the arrow, I will just close this tool palette. As these are annotative object, from here you can change the scale of the object very easily. You can increase the scale, you can reduce the scale as per your requirement. That's all. Thanks for watching. We will stop here.